There's a big controversy in the world of tennis. In Budapest, a ball appeared in right here. See the mark? Good. Prior to, with the surface being clay, chair umpire Morgane Lara would go check. She called it out. Zhang Shuai, seen here, could not believe it because it was the wrong ball mark that chair ump Lara would call out. In disbelief over it and proof it was in, she would call for a referee. Right here is the point of contact when the ball struck the single sideline. The chair ump tries, it appears, getting Zhang to move on, which she will not, as it is a huge point in the first set. She calls for a supervisor, shocked that the evidence is clear, but the call is not reversed. At one point, it appears the chair tells Shuai that's the way it is, though she continues rightfully protesting the call. That's when her opponent, Amarissa Toth, says, F this. Zhang sees what she's about to do, yelling, wait, wait, leave the mark. Toth takes one more glare at Zhang, cares not one bit, winds up her foot, and wipes the mark. What are you doing, shouts Zhang. Her coach is at a loss for words. Why did you do that? Shuai would ask of her opponent. Her team yells at the chair, and when Zhang asks to the chair, why did she do this, Toth wrongly replies, because you're making a problem. That's why. Time was taken. Shuai would have a seat and start tearing up at the injustice. It was shocking to say the least. She would be checked by the doctors and be forced to retire because of a panic attack. She'd follow the customs of shaking hands with the chair and her opponent only to see Toth throw up her hands in triumph another low. She would wave her racket in the air and in turn be shunned by her fellow tennis players Keeping it real, as I always do with y'all, this is one of the more ugly scenes we have seen in professional tennis. Isla Tamjanovic, one of the top singles players in the world, would tweet, absolutely disgusting behavior. Shuai is a better person than a lot of us for shaking the ref in that girl's hand. But then again, it's Shuai we are talking about. Of course she did. Urzula Radwanska would write, the award for unsportsmanlike conduct of the year goes to Amarissa Toth. Australian player Daria Seville would also weigh in. Zero respect for this Toth girl. Zero. I feel so bad for Shuai. This has now opened up the door for technology to be installed, at least for the conversation to take place. That technology should be installed at every single competition for professional tennis via the Hindustan Times. Players are obligated to leave marks on the court as removing them with the racket or foot, something done not to confuse the that excuse me particular mark with other marks, is seen as an admission of that player having lost the point. During the disagreement, fans heckled Shua yelling out, Time violation! Toth was seen laughing in the background. Although she won the game, she was booed. When she retired, Toth celebrated a move widely despised in the tennis world before suggesting she would have won anyway. Toth's ranking going into this match, 548. Via news.com.au. Shuai said last month she has been struggling to cope following the death of her grandparents this year and has also been dealing with personal issues with Chinese tennis officials that have resulted in her staying away from her country for the past three years. At the age of 34, the future is uncertain. Seven News added her mental health and well-being hit the spotlight in May when she broke down in a presser after a 47-minute loss at the French, prompting an outpouring of support from tennis players. She is a two-time Grand Slam doubles champion. And to see her being treated like this is classless, to say the least. She is under tremendous pressure and mentally exhausted after almost three years without coming back to China, wrote a journalist from her country. The story goes as follows. She was cut off by those at the top of the Chinese Federation after opting out of the Olympics. She is practically an outcast from her homeland, receiving zero financial support, which makes winning that much more pivotal.